Today we're going to unlock all the horsepowers with a phone, a Wi-Fi dongle, or an Ethernet cable with a Ethernet to USB-C adapter or whatever your phone uses. Cars are Active Hybrid 3, which is the same or similar as a 335i with an electric motor where the stall converter normally is. It's 100% stock, no mods at all, no performance mods. The motors are N55 with a few little differences. All right, let's ramp it up, see what it makes. All right, better put it in dyno mode. Alright, this is our baseline pull on a completely stock tune. When it comes time to flashing your tune, it's pretty straightforward. I'll leave a link in the description of the comprehensive manual boot mode made. It's pretty easy to follow. Get your tablet or your phone, download the app, um, get your either your Ethernet cable or your dongle, chuck it in your OBD2 port. The location of the OBD2 port is just in the driver's footwork or kick panel. Just plug straight in there. Um, one little trick is you have to know how to access both Wi-Fi and your, your cellular network because you need to be able to connect to the car's Wi-Fi or Ethernet cable as well as connecting to the cloud so that you can update your activation license and your flash. So. I got a little bit impatient figure, trying to figure out how to tether with my phone. Hopefully you can have, have some more luck. I wanted to just use the Wi-Fi module. So I just went and got my Ethernet cable and got it all activated because I didn't really want to wait. All right, once you've got your connection sorted to your vehicle for the first time, you want to run the vehicle activation wizard. Um, just follow the prompts, put in your activation serial that you received via the email and then your account will be set up and ready to go. When you have your app running and connected, there's a nice dashboard that can display all your engine stats that you want. You can change the layout, change what you want to see. When you have a look in my maps, that's where you keep all your own maps. You can grab off the shelf maps or custom maps from your tuner um, you just click on it, download it, and then when you're ready, you just flash it to your car. There's heaps of settings in there you can configure yourself, all your burbles, that kind of stuff. Alright, so I'm going to flash stage one tune, record the results on the screen, and the same with stage two, and I'm going to overlay it over the base runs just so that we can see the, the power gains and differences. Alright this is the first call of the stage one tune.
going to be the second stage two pull. Now let's have a look at the data. Just a quick note to the new players, a dyno is a tuning tool and I'm not really concerned about the peak numbers but just the delta of the before and after. So let's have a look at the maps. Alright I've tidied up all the duplicate runs so it's a bit easier to read. First one obviously our baseline, second one stage one, third one stage two. Um, as you can see, there's a really nice gain of easily 100 horsepower from 250 to 350. Uh, this is the electric motor torque kicking in really early. If it didn't have the electric motor, the power graph would be a bit smoother, or the torque would be a bit smoother. Uh, there's not much difference between uh, stage one and stage two, uh, probably because the DME is being a little bit conservative um, the inlet temps are probably really high and this car still has a cut. Uh, just for the record, I don't recommend uh, jumping straight to straight stage two without the supporting mods. I just did it so that you didn't have to do it. And you can see the numbers are very similar, didn't make much of a difference. So obviously the next videos, there'll be catalyst downpipe, front mount, port injection, high mount, wise fab, two way diff, all the usual goodies. For those of you who want some more numbers, I'll put up all three dialogues of the dyno runs. You can scroll through them and check out all the numbers. Uh, and if you made it this far, thanks for watching and I'll catch you all on the next one.